Drew, how much did you, you guys foul that much, or was the game call tight, or what was going on? There? Uh, we just we put ourselves in some situations where uh, we were more foul prone as a team. Uh, you know, we're never going to blame the game on the ref for a foul discrepancy or anything. You know, we're not going to cry that. It was a hard fought game. It was a very physical game. We just uh, got to be more, a little more disciplined in where we place ourselves. <coughs> Can you guys, any one of you, talk about the strategy of being physical with them? And do you think it bothered Kentucky to just foul and play? Because the just pass back and forth and kind of so they can get it. Um, we just, we just uh, try to use our physicality to see if we can shake the other team. Uh, they won, so I guess they, they, they fought it. So uh, we're just going to keep battling and see what, what happens the rest of the season. Drew, with, with the comments that Coach Woods made earlier in the week that sort of riled everyone up, what, what sort of an effect did you think that might have on Kentucky's players? How did that play out? Uh, I'm, I'm very sorry, but uh, we're only allowed to answer questions about the game. No, no disrespect to your questions, but we've been told to only answer questions about the game. Thank you. Milton, Drew, you guys had. 35 rebounds to Kentucky's 37. I mean, with the length that they have, that Kentucky has, you guys got to be pretty proud about that one. Yeah, I mean, uh, they're very long, very athletic. Um, you know, they're, they, don't, they hardly have to jump in there, they're at the rim. So uh, it's all, all we, we, we worked on really boxing out, uh, really getting into guys. And uh, it, it was hard fought, so I guess from a rebounding standpoint, so I'm going to be down by two. Uh, you know, I mean, you can say we're proud for that. When you talk about the run that you guys made, 16-0 run in the first half, UK counters with a 16-2 run, did you feel it slipping away at that point? Uh, no, nah, we just really tried to keep our composure. Uh, all teams make runs. This is a game of runs, so we were expecting it. We just had to fight hard next time. For both players, it seemed like early in the game, really through, through half, your aggressiveness seemed to have them back on their heels a little bit. Did you have that sense actually on the floor? Well, uh, you know, we wanted to be aggressive defensive and offensively. Um, you know, you really, yeah, you can kind of smell they're, they're a very young team. And don't knock on Kentucky. They're a great team. You know, they're going to make a run in the, in the tournament. Uh, but we use their, their youth try to our advantage. You know, we knew they were young. They're talented as I'll get at now. But, uh, yeah, we tried to use their youth to make them think maybe, you know, they'll pull back and not be as aggressive. But I thought they were still just as aggressive with our defense. Yeah, I, I feel the same way, too. And uh, 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 we got to give them their props on how they handled it and, and finished out the game. What sort of confidence can you bring from, from playing in this type of environment? Man, we just want to win. That's all we want to do. Uh, this game is behind us. It's a thing of the past, so we're just going to move forward and keep trying to win whatever we got to do in practice to keep getting better. What, what, you guys consider this a uh, moral victory? Um, even though you didn't win the game, you guys came out and played very well uh, for the most part. Nah, we, nah, we, we want to win, man. We want to win, man. Like moral victory. There's no such thing as a moral victory in our locker room. We're just going to keep getting better. What did you guys each think that Kentucky did best? Sir, I'm sorry. What did each of you all think that Kentucky did best in the game? <laughs> they they attacked the pressure. Uh, they, they got some fouls by driving to the lane and making plays, getting to the basket. So we just got to cut down on our fouls. In the first half, the, you talked about the pressure uh, without Ryan Harrow as a point guard. Was that the emphasis to really put the pressure on UK's guards? Yeah, uh, we um, they uh, we watched all their games and they hadn't really seen pressure that, that we bring uh, thus far. Uh, but they did a, they did a good job of handling it tonight. But yeah, that was a big key throughout practice this week was really try to pressure their guards and, uh, and to see if they can make the play. <coughs> Uh, no disrespect, but most teams that come in from the OVC don't come into Rupp expecting to win. Did you guys honestly come in here saying, hey, we can beat these guys, honestly? Yes, we Most definitely. Can you tell me about your mindset coming into the game about that, please? Well, 
Um, our whole mindset was it was it was just another game. Yeah, it's Rupp Arena, it's Kentucky, they're top five team in the nation. But, uh, but you know, it, it's a, it's a, it's a it's a game. It's basketball. Um, our mindset, we we really thought we could, we could win this game. There was no doubt about it. Uh, Coach Woods instilled that in us. He instilled that in us at the beginning of the year that we were going to do something special. And this was just just a stepping stone for us. Take two more questions if we have them. With your mindset being that you came here to win, how surprised are you that you didn't? Uh, just expecting to win. Uh, we we're upset that we lost. Uh, we just got some, a lot of things to work on, and hopefully next time we get our shot, we'll do a lot better. Anything else for these guys? Uh, for both of you guys, uh, with with how intense Coach Woods is sometimes on the sidelines, uh, what's that like? <laughs> Doesn't bother us. It's, it's coaching. Uh, you got to accept coaching as a player, and it instills toughness, mental toughness. So I like it. It doesn't make us uncomfortable. <laughs> we handle it very well, and it gets us better. Thank you guys, appreciate it.